Hey everybody. I'm starting dinner. Is this where you want the phone? You yeah, I'm know. working over here. I'm gonna straighten it up. You got it all crooked? Yes, I know I'm live. I'm peeling my taters. I'm going to put some um, eggs on the boil. I'm making me some barbecue chicken and some potato salad. I'm making me some barbecue chicken and some potato salad. So we got both of us in here working around in the kitchen. Uh, the not in a good spot. Uh, yeah, it's all up in in the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is better. Sorry, y'all. Uh, No, that was Haley's hair. Haley was all on the camera. She wanted to give y'all a kiss. She said, hey y'all. I love y'all. Mm -hmm. Laura said you're having an early dinner. Uh, not really. Yeah. I didn't eat lunch. We had breakfast at about 10.30 or so, and we haven't had any lunch, so kind of a combination of our lunch and dinner. <laughs> uh, Nancy, Becky, don't go to our first Friday. What's that? You had your uh, skin tag, so she oh, I'm, Yeah, I go for that Friday. She said she just got a bunch of moves. She's good. I go for it Friday and I'm ready because this thing's sore. It'll be alright though. I've never had one removed so. Y'all was going to go live with y'all this morning, but Facebook was down. Making. I'm doing some barbecue chicken and some potato salad and probably some other veggies. I'll have to do Allen mashed potatoes. Yeah, I ain't no potato salad. That's so nasty. So I got my taters peeled. I'm fixing to rinse them and chop them up. Sharon says she worked all the phone zombies freaking out in the UK. Facebook. Oh. <laughs>
If this wasn't our job, I wouldn't get my darn. If it went down like that. You sharpen my little knife. Y'all give me just a second. I know y'all don't want to stare at my back and my shoulder. How are you, baby? Does your daughter-in-law cook too? What daughter-in-law? Um, granddaughter. My, yeah, my granddaughter's in here cooking now. I think that's what she meant. Uh, Miss Donna sent you some stars. I mean, I have a daughter-in-law, and I'm, she cooks for their family every night. You hear me? Donna sent you some stars. Thanks for the stars, Donna. I appreciate you. Yeah, Haley's our granddaughter. Oh, let me set a timer for these. Oh, and I forgot to pop the bottoms of my eggs, so they're going to be hard to peel. You Turn forgot, it. You forgot what? Tap the bottom of it with the spoon. Oh, yeah. Make it go through. Yeah, Haley is uh, Harmony's mother. I think, ain't you, Haley? Huh? I still think you're Harmony's mother, ain't you? Good job. That's a lot of chicken, ain't it? Yeah. You could have made that into two meals. Oh, I love peeling them taters and cutting them up. Um, Kathy Rowland sent you 500 stars. Thanks for the stars, Kathy. That was sweet, wasn't it? Yes, it was. I appreciate all of you. Um, yeah, we got Harmony's room finished. No, it's not. It's not? No. What's Her that? bed ain't here. Her curtains ain't here. Oh, um, Harmony's room ain't finished. I'll do a video of it, a video of it when it finally gets finished. I mean, like she's got, um, she's sleeping on a, uh, a mattress on the floor right now till her bed gets here, and she's got her TV and her dressers in there, but her room's not finished. <laughs> Terry, but I'm hungry. What you cook? I am making potato salad. Barbecue chicken and some vegetables. Probably open up like some carrots or something. And I don't know though. I, I'm maybe baked beans, potato salad, mashed potatoes and baked beans sounds good. A lot of carbs that I ain't supposed to have, but I'm eating it anyway. I think it'll be okay since I didn't have lunch. Um, I had a small bowl of grits and eggs with two slices of bacon for breakfast. And I mean a small bowl. Uh, Miss okay. Kathy Brooke makes some stars. Thanks for the stars, Kathy. So y'all, I'm starving. I'm ready to eat. Kind of thing. So, like your pants, where'd you get those? Uh, I've had these. I used to have them in my boutique. 
But I don't have my little boutique no more. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Y'all know I love me some leggings. I live in, in uh, leggings. Uh, Kathy Birch sent you some stars. Thank for the stars, Kathy. Helen, that's Harmony. I mean, that's Haley, our granddaughter, Harmony's mother. She asked who was just in the kitchen. Oh yeah, that's my um, granddaughter Haley. Um, Haley's my granddaughter. Harmony is my great granddaughter. All right, we got our eggs boiling. I'm gonna get my chicken in the oven. I can't believe y'all cooked that much chicken. So let me do that. I eat it all day, yes, all day, all night, and all day. Wait, but I eat it like it was gone. They're all like Becky McGlam's meal: meatloaf and fried potatoes with onions. Oh, that sounds good. Oh, I don't want some meatloaf, but that's on the menu sometimes. It's like that. Okay. I love meatloaf a lot better than chicken. You said what? I love meatloaf better than chicken. Oh, so my. This is the other girl right here. We're going to have to get some hard Yeah, this is enough. I just want to cover that circle. Um, Miss Lee Bland since she's baby. Thanks for the stars, Miss Lee. How was Michelle? She's okay. She's good. We went over to her house for a little while last night. Yeah, we went over there for about an hour or so. No, Terry Baker's not on any kind of diet. No, but I am trying to uh, fast. I am trying to do the like 16-8 fast to try to drop some weight because of my liver and all. But I'm not on no specific diet. It's hard to do. She tries not to eat till 12 o'clock in the morning. But I'll get up and make some breakfast and she'll be like, dang, I'm hungry. Saboteur. <laughs> Some long you won't put nothing in them. They're not French cut. Oh, then I ain't eating them. They're right. snapped. Yeah, what? I ain't eating them. Um, and I just need the garlic. Y'all, I'm just cutting that chicken so that it's not so thick. Are you going to eat I don't know. I'm on, yeah, I'll eat some of them. If it's a veggie, I'll eat some of it. I got chicken on my hands and I don't want to touch it. 
Yeah, Haley's baking her chicken, and Becky's uh, baking barbecue chicken. I'm just going to put a little salt and pepper on this. Right. Because I'm doing barbecue, I don't want a lot of spices or nothing on it. Are you eating cream corn? Yeah, uh, Lila. Are you eating cream corn now? Haley's daughter is uh, Harmony. I don't know, Haley. I don't know if you've seen her on our live or not, but and she's got a boyfriend slash almost husband. I'm going to put the aluminum foil on it. Good Lord, there's nowhere for me to put it in the oven. Do you need this uh, rotisserie? No. Right. I may not get done way up there, will it? It'll get done, but... Where do you bleach water at? Uh, my bottle of bleach is up there. But I never put the chicken on the counter. Oh, you didn't? No. The chicken never touched the counter. It was on that bread pan. Oh. Harmony. And I just washed that pan. Okay. This is my potato peels. They're going to go out and get thrown in the garden spot. And I'm going to chop up some, get some onion. Not onions. I don't like onions in my potato salad. Ugh. I'm going to get pickles chopped up for my potato salad.
I gotta get me one of those pickle jars for the fridge that um you turned upside down that lets all the water drain down so you can get the pickle without getting all in the juice. I wanna get one of those. I think she bumped her head under the table. Come here, that sink, she hit her soft spot. <laughs> Becky, Becky said, hey. Hey, Becky. <laughs> Gotta cut the ends off these pickles. I don't like the ends. Kind of like the end of the McDonald's French fry. Katie <laughs> uh, said, why don't you just buy relish? Uh, I don't know. I've just always cut pickles up. Kathleen said never throw out pickle juice. Why is that? Uh, Lynn sent you some stars. Thank you for the stars, Lynn. Well, I have a lot of jars of pickles in the fridge. Why don't you say don't throw the pickle juice away? A lot of people drink pickle juice. Uh, well, we don't drink it. It'd just be sitting around for nothing. And I know some people who cut up cucumbers and put it in the pickle juice. And like remake their own pickles with it. Um, um, what? She got mad, and I went in there five minutes later. She destroyed the room. She got that mad. That should be alright. She destroyed her room. Y'all talking about? She took all the drawers out of that nightstand thing and tipped the whole thing over. She threw all the drawers out of it, tipped it over. <laughs> I was like, girl, I spent a lot of money on this. She's having a hissy fit, huh? Oh, they say it's good to drink the cramping. I probably should have drank me some. My big toes have been killing me. Big toe? Yes. I keep getting cramps <laughs> in my big toe and it draws up. Oh, this is what it's asking. I even asked. I don't know, but sometimes it hurts to step down on it. It'll get like that. For a few days and it'll stop. Oh, it ain't low salt because uh, the sodium, because I eat tons of salt. I eat plenty of bananas, I never cramp. So my potato salad is really, really simple, y'all. It consists of dill pickles, boiled eggs, potatoes, mayonnaise, and mustard, salt, and pepper. I don't do the onions or any of the other stuff that people put in theirs. I like mine kind of, I guess you'd say kind of plain. What you got, Harmony? It's ours. More shoes? Okay, now we can throw that away. Yes. Huh? Yes. All right. And our eggs are fixing the time machine to go off. It's not rainbow shoes. Here. Rainbow shoes. Can you put them on? Yeah, so you put them on. Somebody says egg? Here. Yes, I put eggs in mine. Mm -hmm.
Teresa said they do uh, chopped onions in hers. Yeah, I know a lot of people like chopped onions in it. I don't do well with um, raw onions. Because I have uh, acid reflux and all. So I don't put onions in mine. Well, I mean, paprika's fine. Where'd you get those at, baby? Hey, these are feeling Walmart. pretty good considering I didn't tap them. Whoa, so awesome. Becky, she said Walmart. <laughs> Say it again, Herman. Say Walmart. 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 <laughs> she says Walmart. Look at my new shoes, Nanny. Look at my new shoes. All right, come over here and see if they can see your new shoes. Stand over there beside Nanny and face the camera. Over there. Don't you put it there and say, look at my new shoes. Look at my new shoes. We've got some pretty sandals. Well, I gotta go in my room. Okay. Well, I gotta go in my room. She's getting such a um, personality now, and, and it's going to be a girly personality. She loves her dresses and her jewelry and her, she's a little shoe fan. Anything pink? Yes. And her water boots. Oh, God, yes, her rain boots, her glittery rain boots. Pink. She would wear those things with everything. I mean, which I love my rain boots, but they were hid in that closet for so long. Okay. Let's cut my eggs up. Honey, that starts getting hot in the hand. What? That hot egg. Oh, I see the steam coming off of it. I thought it was cutting up onions in your hand like that. No. I'm cutting my egg up. Uh, Teresa, there's the normal people here tonight. One, two. Three, four, six people, because Harmony ain't gonna eat. Uh, yeah, we had our first child at 20. Becky was 20, I was, I mean, I was 20, she was 18. That's pretty young, yeah. Y'all know what they say, babies having babies. We were babies having babies. But I didn't feel like a baby, because I'd always help take care of kids at my mama's house. Yeah, it, I think I think they cooked too much chicken, too. But she said she didn't know how many people because of all that chicken. Oh, no, no, no. What doesn't get ate tonight will get put up for lunch tomorrow. And I eat it all night anyways. Yeah, my son Mike tries to tries to uh out eat everybody. Mommy. What? Kathleen said, how do you keep from cutting yourself? You what? As soon as I feel I'm going slow and as soon as I feel the knife hit the skin, I pull back up. 
I'm doing it really easy. Look, I'll show you. I'm doing it like this. Can they see? And as soon as it touches my skin, I pull back up. Lori and Alice said that's how they do theirs. It's cheese, cheese, cheese. And more cheese. When yeah, Michelle we... was little, she went through a macaroni and cheese stage. She come home in, in middle school. She went through her macaroni and cheese stage. She'd come home from school every day and cook a box of macaroni and cheese. Every single day. That, that went on for a couple of years. Where's Michelle? She's at home. Okay. And Pooh, he went through his Pooh hot, went hot through, dog stage. Pooh went through a bologna and hot dog stage where he would throw a bologna or a piece of bologna or a hot dog in the microwave and cook it until Ooh, it was unrecognizable. And he ate it that way. And he also went through a bacon stage where he tried to eat nothing but uh, bacon for breakfast. Okay. Who? Hey. Who? So these are done. I want to get them in some cold water, stop the cooking, so they're not mush. Oh, Karen, Karen's in Ireland. Oh, wow. All right. Okay, that's not big enough. Man said cheesy salsa over any vegetables. Uh huh. Laura says first thing she to cook is mac and cheese. Harmony's went through her mac and cheese thing. She passed out. Oh, that's out. all she wanted to eat. Yeah, she passed out. She, yeah, she's gotten to the point it's not uh, mac and cheese all the time. But it's always cheese. No matter what, it's always cheese. Every day. All right, Carmel, have a good girl. Good night, girl. All right, I'm gonna let those sit for just a second in that water while I get my mayonnaise and my mustard.
I think Dion's been sitting with the jar of uh, mustard with his family again. Mayonnaise. Yeah, mayonnaise. <laughs> Uh, Julia, I don't know if the cheese messing with her stomach or not. Who, the baby? Yeah. Nope. I thought it would constipate her too, but she does just fine. She'll eat half a block of cheese and crap a whole block of cheese and start all over. <laughs> Mama always told us it was going to make you constipated. It don't bother that baby. That must have been a wild tale. No, if you eat too much cheese, if that pizza, too much of the um, pizza cheese, you have to you. I can't eat a whole pizza. Well, that's She kind of rotates though between sliced cheese and cheddar cheese. So, y'all know sliced cheese is mostly milk. Marmonese. And she doesn't say sliced cheese. It's so cute. She'll come say, Noni, Noni, will you give me a piece of iced cheese? <laughs> She says I said instead of sliced. Okay, we got our potatoes. And I did about five regular sized potatoes and five eggs. Y'all gonna tear that up, ain't you? I sure am. You dropped the egg somewhere. Yeah. Well, that's alright. I'll get it when I sleep. My pickles. Yeah. I seen something fall and bounce. Well, Alan, come search the floor. No, I ain't doing that. I told you I'll get it when I sweep. I sweep this uh, kitchen every time I wash dishes. I will find it. Right. Big gobs of mayonnaise. I'm going to start with two big gobs. I'm going to say that's about a half a cup of mayonnaise. Mm. Two good big squirts of mustard. Tell us, what kind of mayo are you using? Blue plate. I thought you used dukes. No, I don't use no dukes. You got dinky dukes. I'm from the south, but I don't like dukes mayonnaise. Ew, I don't like no I grew up on blue plate. Love blue plate. I don't like blue plate. You say what? I don't like no man. Do you like no man? No, I ain't gonna eat no man. But I don't like ranch dressing either. I love it with some ranch dressing. Harmony don't like ranch at all. Or mayonnaise. That's because you and Dion drank it. What? D Harmony does not like mayonnaise and she does not like ranch. Haley drinks ranch and he sits with a jar of man um, mayo. I know Haley's side of the bed. She's got a five gallon jug up with a hose going down right to her mouth and she's laying in bed sucking on ranch. No, I don't. That is nasty. I don't like, I will not eat ranch by myself, but I ain't dipping into something. Or just put something in it, I'm not. And Dion eats so much mayonnaise, we go through a, like a jar of this a week. Oh my God. Don't Debbie said no onion? No onion. Don't even get started right now. He eats mayonnaise on some pop. But he's skinny. He's so skinny, he needs to eat mayonnaise. He's a lot of calories. He eats mayonnaise on chicken nuggets, hot pockets, pizza. Of course, I don't know that it's good hey, for his arteries. <laughs> Nanny, for how much I eat, it still don't do anything. I walk it off to work. Yeah. <laughs> then you so said deal or sweet? Pickles. Deal pickles. 
I don't like the like the sweet pickles, like the bread and butter and all. And those are good. Yeah, those are disgusting. Uh, Vic really said, "Hey, she's in uh, England." Harmony. Okay. Now I already know this needs salt because I ain't put no salt in it. I'm surprised I'm showing it on the front of the What color is your shirt? Brown shirt? Yeah. Green? Oh. You can't tell? No. It's bright green. It looked blueish. Yeah. Like blue. Or no, no, I'm lying. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Alan wants a look. Look, Alan, you want a big old bite on no, I ain't looking at that. I got my head covered up. I even got the phone turned away from me. That's good stuff. I got to turn the phone for about 30 seconds. That's good stuff. Hey, Harmony, come here. What do you, what do you want to eat? Oh. Harmony what she wants to eat and she said mama I can't think about it uh, Lee Vix Lee said very nice to meet you I live in the UK well, welcome. England? Oh, I thought it was England. You don't know what United Kingdom is? I thought it was All right. She thought, Haley thought UK yeah. was Georgia. And Georgia. I'm going to get oh, these. God. I'm going to get these uh, dishes here washed and we're going to pull that chicken out and check on it. Look, Harmony. Go this way, baby. I got Go around that way. There's another entrance. Go all the way around. There you go. Can I have these sandwiches? Can I have them? No, Where'd you get your strainer at? Uh, it come from Amazon. One of my followers got it for me for Christmas. It comes in a set of three. Now, Becky won't let nobody else do the dishes. Okay. She wants to know her dishes are clean. Haley did them for me the other day when I wasn't feeling good. Oh, yeah, Brenda. I didn't know what you was talking about, Mama Red. I said, well, she'll read comments and she'll see it's Becky, not Red. <laughs> okay. There must be another cook named Mama Red. Oh, it's all good. Oh, you just spilled that oh. all over the stove. Oh, shit. You got to clean up. Clean up all one. Haley, that should have went into one of the deep pans. Uh, Elizabeth said hello. She's new. Hey, Elizabeth. Yeah, I guess so. Because I usually don't make this much. Okay, get a deep pan. Let me help you out here. Yeah, she's all over the camera, dude. But I guess that's all right. What, did it overfill the pieces? Yeah. You weren't thinking about that, was you? No. And Miss Elizabeth is from Kentucky. Well, we're all down in Georgia. I gotta flip it, and then I but we we put extra season on the back on the other side of our side. I flip them. I flip it, and then okay. Well, take this 
over to the table to flip it and let me get this mess up. No. And if any of y'all want to follow us, take your phone and just, all you got to do is tap your screen. Don't tap it on the comment. And hit that follow button right there. Just tap your screen up here somewhere. Did you get down inside it? Yeah, but I needed to clean down inside it anyways because somebody's been spilling a lot down in it. What me? They had a boo boo. Stay there. Haley, uh, Elizabeth said, what you got on your chicken? Um, lemon pepper and rotisserie seasoning. Be careful whenever you pull that out and don't splash the oil out of it. You got trivet? Need you to it. Nancy, Vicky, we're having uh, baked chicken, lemon pepper chicken, and Becky's doing uh, barbecue chicken bar and potato salad. Barbecue chicken. But they spilled something in the oven, so she had to get it out. Or in the stove. No, Peggy, we want it cleaned up right. Heavy wouldn't clean it up right. She said the one spilled it should be cleaning it. Becky wants hers clean. 
I'm particular. I'm one of those people. I want it done my way. Can't nobody do it to my satisfaction, so. Uh-uh. If Haley did it, Becky would just have to go back and redo I'd it. I'd just go back and redo it because it wouldn't be good enough. I'm always that way. Yep. Like I said, th this ain't good enough for me either. I'll take a Brillo pad and do it later. Got to get you through the live on it. Yep. Yeah, Becky won't let nobody wash her dishes. Michelle used to wash them. Where Michelle? But you know, Michelle didn't wash them for a long time. She trusted time. Michelle to wash them, but she won't let Hadley wash dishes. But every now and then, she washed them for me the other day when I didn't feel good. But you got corn and green beans. Um, yeah. I'll eat some of the corn, you know that. I won't. It's not the kind of thing I like. Carrie says she does like you. Cleans as she goes. You have to around here. If you don't, you'll end up with so much you can't. Can't keep up. Can't keep up. Linda says she's the same way as you. Rather clean it myself. That's like me when I'm doing something around here. I want to do it myself. I don't want nobody helping me. I don't. Y'all know one of the biggest things that me and Alan had a problem with was when he would make me a drink or make me ice water. He could never get it right. Simple ice water, I'll get it wrong. He did not put the right amount of ice in my drinks. That's or how the, Dion does. I or, like a lot of or ice. Or the right kind of ice. I'd use crushed. She wanted solid. I'd use solid. She'd want crushed. Finally, I'm like, I ain't making you no water. I'm bringing you a bottle of water. I used to be so picky about my ice water because I lived off ice water. I constantly had a glass of ice water in my hand. And he could not make my my water right. Yeah, I forget who sent Becky them salt and pepper shakers. One of my followers sent me those, and they sent me the little mini ones. And y'all, I keep the mini ones beside my bed with salt and pepper in it. Because sometimes I go in there and sit on my bed and eat dinner and watch a movie. And, um... I sit in there every night and I slice up an orange and I eat an orange with salt. So I keep a salt and sugar shaker by my bed. Uh, Alan, I'm having problems with this one. Never mind, I got it. Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. I have to pull the top off of So let, let me show y'all the little ones. I'll go grab them right quick. <laughs> yeah, they're finished Tupperware. They're probably 20 years old, I bet. What? These little salt and pepper shakers she's got. These small ones, they stay beside my bed full of salt and pepper. How do you look compared to the big one? Says she's the one who sent them to you, and she's glad you like them. I do, I love them. Miss Linda and Dara. And Dara. She's been watching you for a long Linda, time. Linda, I love them. They didn't have a name. The package didn't have a name on them. Yeah, we didn't know who they came I from. I didn't know who they came from. But I love them. I keep the small ones, like I said, by my bed. And the big ones stay right here in the kitchen. Yeah, I think it's Tupperware. Unless we're eating, yeah, they're Tupperware. Unless we're we're at the dining room eating. But I, I love them. I absolutely love them. So thank you so much. Kathleen said her big ones have red tips. Okay, my chicken's not even cooking yet. Uh, swap her one of her for yours. Or is it ring? Or? Um. Haley, you turned the oven off? I ain't turned it off. 
I ain't touched that button. She I didn't turn it off. What did it turn off by itself? She ain't been nowhere near it, have you? I ain't had it. When she was doing her chicken, I thought when she spilt it, she reached up and turned the oven off. Uh-uh. No, did I do it? I don't know. I think you did it when you uh, was cleaning it. Okay. That's not going to work either. Turn that some. Does that work? Just, it, it is what it is. It'll cook eventually. I ain't in that big of a hurry. <sighs> Okay, guys, I'm going to hop off, let this chicken cook, because it's going to take it a while. Mine hasn't even started cooking. Isn't that weird? The thing that was cooking was on the bottom rack, piece of junk. But anyways, I'll come back in a little while when uh, my chicken and I'll get close to done. Y'all have a great one. Bye, y'all.